Hi Scorpio, welcome to your weekly reading for April 9th until April 15th, 2019. All right, let's just jump right in. Okay, so first of all, in the what's going to happen, you have the seven of coins in reverse, and in the how, you have seven of swords in the upright. In the why, you have seven of cups in reverse. How you're gonna feel, you have eight of wands in reverse. Advice, you have the Strength card in the upright, and at the bottom of the deck, you have the King of Swords in reverse. So let's go back to the beginning. Seven of Coins in reverse. Um, this, is, um, this is meaning being worried over something that you've recently started. This can also mean trying to get attention, um, trying to do something different to get an effect, maybe a new job or a new business, maybe you're trying to promote something. Um, in the how, you have the Seven of Swords, and this means that you're waiting for news or you're, or something to change, waiting for something to change. Um, this can also mean trying to force change and taking a risk to get change. Um, it can also be um, regardless of consequences. All right, so at the in the why, you have the Seven of Cups in reverse, and this means planning for hobbies. This can mean planning for a marriage. This can also mean emotional manipulation. Um, somebody, somebody emotionally manipulating someone for their own gain, um, like a like a user, someone that you know just says what you want to hear because they want something out of you. Okay, and how you feel? You have the Eight of Wands in the reverse, and that's feeling embarrassed. That's regretting something. That's remembering things that you don't want to. Um, this can mean that you're having trouble with your reputation. This can also mean someone, yeah, you you might be feeling um, er, eight arrows. That's that's also quick. It's like um, maybe all of a sudden you're feeling like um, like your reputation is is uh, being affected somehow, um, and and it's making you feel embarrassed. It can also be um, feeling like you're you're needy like you're needy of um validation that type of thing and it's right beside this seven of cups in reverse which talks about emotional manipulation and marriage so to me it's telling me that um somebody might have kind of future faked you or something like that i hope not um okay and then in the advice you have the strength card this is um this means that success from hard work um it means that your moral code is getting noticed um, it's in your advice section, so I think it's sane to follow um, the golden rule. Um, it also means be brave. This also, um, it's about soft control. The um, patience, compassion, strength, morality, courage, all those good things. Um, that's your advice, is to, um, is to use all of those strength character, characteristics within you. And then at the bottom of the deck, you have the King of Swords in the reverse. And this is basically someone you want to avoid. This is a cruel person. Um, they're, they're, they're fake. They, they manipulate people. And he's right below this manipulation. So to me, I'm, I'm, right away, I'm seeing some guy. But you're still looking at him, and he's still looking at you. So you're using your strength to maybe stay away from him. Um, below the, or sorry, above the strength card, you have the Seven of swords in the upright and on this end this is getting advice so that's what you maybe you got advice to get um i don't know um deal with this person or maybe you need to get advice on dealing with this person that could be a lawyer that could be a therapist that could be you know real estate agent it could be anything but you have sage advice right above your advice card so and then you have this um planning for pastimes in marriage above this king of swords in reverse. So maybe, hmm, let me see it here. So the why, you're worried because of all the manipulation, I think. Um, and this could also have to do with work because this is, this is like a job thing to me um, on all the coins. And you also have three sevens in a row. So to me, that says lucky right away. And you do have the it's you have the strength card in your advice, so that is um, that is definitely your advice. I think you're gonna have to be strong to try and avoid this guy that pulls on your heartstrings, maybe something like that. 
Okay, so that is your reading for this week, Scorpio, and your song is called Amy Jane's Flying Carpet, and it's by the Holy Family. I'll write it out in the description for you. All right, have a great week. Love you. Bye.